Oh, he went for it. Let's go, Gon. I'm vibing with this so hard right now. Talk to him, Killua. It's time. Real quick before this episode of Hunter Hunter here, if you guys are enjoying these videos, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more. And consider checking out the Patreon. I'm currently several episodes ahead for both Hunter Hunter and Avatar. If that's something you're interested in, the link will be in the description below. And with all that being said, enjoy the video. Please be straight away, please. I'm so down. The true pass. I know what that means. Individual styles, yes. Okay. Six? Oh, no. Okay. Oh, this is good stuff. I feel like we've seen a bunch of these already. Specialists. It's all good stuff. So many different styles. Okay. Boy's got a lot of this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Enhancer? Right, okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I like that. It's so much deeper than, than I thought it was. Yeah, okay, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, okay. That's so he needs to refine that to be closer to the enhancer, right? Yeah, I see. Makes sense. Okay, this is really important stuff to know then, I feel. Oh, okay, this works then. That's pretty dope. That's so exciting though. So what is wing then? The amount of water changes. I see. Oh, this is exciting. Let's find out what they are. Now I thought Gon might be an enhancer. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Manipulator for Zushi. <laughs> He's stressed. Taste the water? Oh, sweet? What'd that mean? Man Manipulator? Transmuter? Ooh, that sounds exciting. He likes that. Look at him. Okay, nice. Now we can work on our techniques. I'm going to look at the diagram after this to make sure I know which ones they, they should be aiming to work with along with their main one. Because that's really cool. Hisoka? It's time. My brother in Christ. Put some clothes on. <laughs> Let's go. I'm so here for it. Is this his Nen? Is he getting excited? Look at him. Jesus Christ. Why does he have to be naked? Just looking out over the whole city. What a demon. He, we need more water. We want it to be looking like wings. How much is the taste going to have changed? A lot more? Oh. 
Oh, yeah. We got that honey water. Good, good. Seems a lot harder for Zushi, maybe. Which would make sense. He really has to work for it. Oh, that's tough. But to be expected, though, compared to Killer and Gone. How much water now, Gone? Okay. He broke the glass. This is- he is the guy. He is the guy. Oh, let's go! The real- the real pass? Of the hunter exams, maybe? Yes! This is it! Oh, that's so dope! The secret hunter exam. Like, like, getting a grasp on Nan? Oh, that's so dope. I need a Kurapika update. So I wonder if Wing is, is here for a reason, right? To kind of train Gon, maybe? In the same way that whoever Kurapika is learning from was kind of there at, at a very convenient time to teach Kurapika. But I'm not sure because given the way this whole happened, like Wing and Zushi were already here at Heaven's Arena. So maybe it's more about them finding their own way to master Ned. But, but a, a really cool like extra thing they added onto the Hunter exams here. I like that. And they keep it out of the Hunter exam. So not everyone can just learn Ned. And there it is! It's Netero! Oh, of course! I should have known that that's Wing's master. Yes. Yes. And then it's an easy win for him. Because he, he will already have passed Nen. I hope he does, man. Hanzo! Yes! Look at Kurapika! Look at my boy! Well, I've got chills a little bit. Yeah, don't do too much. Whoa. Oh, this is just absolutely fantastic stuff right now. Oh, poor Zushi, man. He'll get there, though. Don't compare yourself to Gon and Killua. Let's go. Wing knows what to say. Yeah. Then you're not comparable. Oh. <laughs> Maybe he doesn't know what to say. Good. It's motivation. This track is getting to me, man. Oh. Everyone's here for this fight. Oh, this is hey, this is going to be a big deal, man. Oh, I I don't know what to expect anymore. I'm nervous, bro. How much longer is in this episode? Well, there's, there's a little bit left. Hold on, we might be doing something. Oh. Look at my boy. Oh yeah, he's locked in. Is this a Hisoka thing? Come on now. <laughs> It was for gone. You're lying. Give that man some respect. Nah, it's it's not the fishing rod. He needs to punch him. Oh yeah. Right, they they're pulling out all the stops for this one. Wait, I'm so excited. He's getting stretched. He, he, he's kind of looking like he's getting ready to actually fight. Oh, look at this! He is locked in. Uh, don't be weird about it, man. Yo, no, no, what do you mean? Uh, 
Do not leave me. Do not leave me hanging here. Come on. Just give me a little bit. Just give me a little bit. Come on. Here we go. Yep. Oh, we're still going though. Bro, this is really good stuff. The, the, the ambience. He's really trying to land that punch. Look at him. He's hanging in there. We know he can take a beating. Not backing down. Come on. Oh, he blocked it. Oh, he blocked that too. I'm so zoned in on this right now. All of that for one point. Man, but, but Gon, he's holding his own. Hisoka, I reckon, is kind of playing with him, but th this is really good. Oh, come on, man. Gon's so focused on trying to land that one punch. Here we go. There we go. Calm down a bit. Hisoka's reading him like a book. Yep, yep. We know this. Can Gon use that to his advantage? We, we might get something here. He's, just, he's only fainting now. Oh, okay. Make him move. Lift the one here. Oh, here we go. He, he, he so has to do something now. Don't do it! Don't do it! No shot! He got him! Did he actually get him? I thought the episode was going to end. Stop it, mate! We actually did it! He could be a hunter now! Yeah, yeah, okay. He's is gonna go nuts next episode. Man! Oh, dude. Dude, that is single-handedly the best episode of the show thus far. What episode is this? Mark it down. 35? They crammed so much into that. They got their bloody Nen classes. We got a really sick exchange between Gon and Hisoka. Gon actually hit Hisoka. I, I am immensely satisfied right now. These are the kind of moments where like, you're in the middle of a show like this and really good things are happening. I just want to take it all in, man. Like you only get this once. You don't get to relive these moments. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna sit here. I don't know for how long it's gonna be, but I'm just so happy. Now this is one of those episodes where so much changes all at once. So not just Gon, but Hanzo and Kurapika as well have passed the secret hunter exam test, which is learning Nen. And that's what we assumed was the case. And I just love when they add extra things in like that. You think the hunter exam's done, but no, there's more. There's this entire concept of Nen. So I believe that Netero was actually Wing's master, right? There was a lot going on at the time and I wasn't taking everything in, but I'm pretty sure that's what Wing said. So when Wing was referring to his master, he was referring to Netero. Yeah, Wing says here, the head Shingen Ryu master is Netero. And that's what we saw Netero using when he fought Gon and Killua. They pushed him just enough so he had to use a little bit of his Nen. And Kurapika behind the scenes has already gotten to this level with Nen as well. And Kurapika was looking sick. Kind of a different getup, I think, maybe? But was looking really cool. I really want to see Kurapika back in the show really soon. Maybe even, maybe it won't be until the York New City stuff. But Kurapika is going to be up there with Killua and Gon. That's great. And, and just like I, I kind of thought, uh, Leo is just focusing on studying so he's working hard but not necessarily on his Nen stuff but I love that they do send people out to teach them Nen and only after they've passed the exam because like Wing was saying kind of dangerous to just teach everyone in the hunter exams how to use Nen right because it can be used for some pretty silly things you know like, like for example Illumi and Hisoka but I absolutely loved all of that I'm going to go through and, and look at that hexagon now of all the, the different types of Nen stuff and really get my mind around uh, each of uh, Gon, Killua and Zushi styles and what they could possibly uh, be branching off into. Okay, so Gon was an enhancer, yes? So that means 
emitter and transmuter are going to be the two things that he'll be able to do as well. Zushi was a manipulator, so emitter and specialist for him. And Killua was a transmuter, so he actually intersects a lot with Gon. Uh, so he can do enhancer and conjurer as well. So both of them can do enhancing and transmuting, which is really cool. And I love the explanation of Castro saying he was more of an enhancer type, but the other skills he were using were too far away from that. And that's why he was squandering a lot of his potential. So perhaps he just didn't know about all of this stuff and he just went off on his own and this is what he came up with. But now that the boys know this, it's really big time because now they can go out of their way to make sure they're using the most of their Nens. And again, with all this talk of like their individual Nens stuff and what they can do with it, it's just so exciting. I really love stuff like this. Can't wait to see all their individual styles. I imagine we're going to see so many other different Nens styles once we get into the Phantom Troop, once we see Kurapika again and even Hanzo. Just really good stuff. So much to look forward to right now. We still got like you know over 100 episodes left right oh it's just gonna be good and poor Zushi you know uh, but like Wing was saying look Gon and Killua are just incomparable to Zushi and he shouldn't take that in a bad way because Zushi is still making a lot of progress and Zushi and Wing I know are characters we'll be seeing more of in the future I'd love to see Zushi come back into the show at some point after he's been training and he's just a, a big force as well I love stuff like that and when Gon passed the secret test the amount of water that was coming out of that cup I don't know if Wing was doing it like a, as much as he could when he displayed his enhancer kind of thing with the water but Gons was like he broke the glass and Wing was like damn th this kid's doing stuff and this is making me think back to the hunter exams in the final exam in the fights where they got listed like based on their potential and Gon was significantly ahead of Killua and Killua was questioning if Gon had more potential than himself and this might be hinting at that a little bit more just by how much Gon has improved his Nen ability in such a short amount of time there is a chance that Killua right now is still a bit stronger than Gon, but Gon is really showing that his potential might be significantly greater than Killua's. And then that makes me think back to what Illumi is saying, that there is still a bit of assassin in Killua. At some point, he's going to realize if he's stronger than Gon. Maybe Gon is going to maybe show that he's stronger. Killua is going to take offense to that. I don't know how we're even going to get there. Maybe Illumi might do some more like hypnotizing things. I don't know. And then we have like a Gon and Killua conflict. Wouldn't that just be insane? Like that is still hanging over the show as a possibility. But right now, I, I think their friendship and the way they're helping each other get strong it is one of the, the, the best things in the show right now. Which would make it even crazier if something does get in the way with that. But we'll see. I think that might be ages and ages away. And through all of that, we still managed to cram in an extremely significant part of Hisoka and Gon's fight. And it was a really big deal. So many people there, a really big event. They really put a show on for it. People were about it. And not for one second do you think Hisoka is going to lose this fight. You do not think Gon is going to win. That's not the point. We've been harping on about it all the time it's just about Gon landing that one blow he said he was not going to use his hunter's license or call himself a hunter until he lands that blow on his soccer and he has done it like it, it was a crazy it was a sick fight such a really cool back and forth his soccer didn't move his soccer knew he was the strongest I'm not even going to talk about like what was he saying he's getting turned on he's an actual freak with it like I, I'm really hoping he's just talking about you, you know the, the thrill of the fight you know it's the same thing for Gon right he's just being weird about it he's been his soccer with it but that that, that was crazy but Hisoka was just enjoying himself. You know, you could see Gon was really going for that blow. Almost every punch was aimed to try and hit Hisoka in the face. You know, that, that's all he wanted. But once he calmed down and he realized, right, Hisoka, he knows he's stronger. Gon's done his thing. You know, he's flipped up one of the tiles. And I imagine he was using his Zetsu there, right? Because Hisoka had no idea where Gon was. And, oh, the, dude, and the shots, the way there was like no music in, in the background, the, the whole exchange was fantastic. And I really thought they were going to cliffhanger us. Like as soon as Gon's fist came at the screen, I'm like, if they cliffhanger here, I'm flipping my monitor over. I'm never watching the show again. But he got him. And the narrator said, you know, Gon is probably going to feel Hisoka's wrath. Even though he's enjoyed quite a beating already, I imagine Hisoka might go a little bit nuts next episode. But in the space of one episode, Gon has passed the secret hunter exam and learnt Nen properly. And he's landed his blow on Hisoka. I thought this might not happen until York knew. But he can be an actual proper hunter now assuming he survives th this fight well enough against Hisoka at the end of the next episode but that was absolutely fantastic I thoroughly enjoyed that episode they crammed so much in but they didn't waste any of it so many more details about Nen I don't know if you can get much more deeper than this I imagine it probably will and we've just advanced so far in the plot that I don't even know like what's going to come next now so many of the things that were like hanging over the show ha have been dealt with we've got a handle on Nen now we've punched Hisoka in the face Kurapika and Leorio are in the background 
going, doing their own things. So I'm gonna leave this one here. I can't wait to get to the next episode and see what happens with all of that. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you wanna see more. And as always, please continue to leave your comments and feedback down below. You know, I always appreciate it. And we'll see y'all in the next episode of Hunter Hunter. Holy shit, that was so good.